beautiful people. Thank you so much for tuning in on this, my first official post of December. Um, it's Christmas month. If you know me, you know I love Christmas. I'm sorry if I forgot all the other holidays this year, such as Thanksgiving. I hope you guys had a great time. Diwali was not that long ago. I'm useless, but Christmas is my favorite time of year ever. So this December, we're starting off with, um, a Christmas tune, one of my favorites, We Three Kings. It's a nice slow one. I'm going to put in some harp and I'm also playing on this gorgeous JPW Instruments new whistle that I've been sent. Um, I'm going to be talking more about this whistle later in the video after the tutorial, so stay tuned to hear about this. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this Christmas tutorial. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, that's the tune, and now to the whistle. This whistle is a JPW Instruments whistle, as I mentioned previously in the video. As you can see, it looks and sounds absolutely amazing. This one is actually a prototype, so it's a little heavier than the whistles will actually be when they're in production. But James Wilkinson, the guy who makes these, is currently unable to uh, basically add the finishing touches and complete the finishing steps of making these whistles because he's working from this tiny little uninsulated shed of a workshop in his garden in the UK. So in order to get these back into full production and to get these amazing whistles out to tin whistle players worldwide, James has launched a crowdfunding campaign here, um, which I'm going to put links to in the description below. I'll also try and link on my social media channels as well. Um, he's raising money to basically improve his workshop and get these back into full-time production so that people worldwide can enjoy these amazing whistles. Um, a little bit about these whistles, they're very easy to hit all the notes. They have a beautiful clear voice. This one in particular he said was going to be quiet, but really it's one of the louder, clearer whistles I own. It's one that would be amazing in sessions. Um, it really is very different to a lot of other whistles I've played, mainly because of the weight and the look of it, but also the sound that it gives out. It's got quite a pure and um, kind of angelic voice to it. Definitely one that you'd want to play loud and proud and get heard. Um, it looks absolutely gorgeous. It's beautifully finished. There's a lovely little Celtic logo on the front here. Um, it really is a gorgeous whistle. So if you guys are interested in helping this amazing whistle maker to get back into the world of making and you want to be able to order and play these whistles yourself in the coming months, then please do head over and check out the fundraiser and show your support. It would be greatly appreciated by James and obviously we get to enjoy more of these amazing whistles. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed hearing this whistle. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. If you have comments, questions, suggestions, more whistles you'd like to hear, let me know down below in the comments. And I'll see you guys way more often throughout December because I have so much to pack in. I have commissions, I have Christmas tunes, I have collaborations, I have so many things I want to do. So you'll be seeing a lot of me throughout December. Happy whistling. I'll see you guys very soon. And until then, enjoy. Bye.